What's going on guys? It's LexiVO3 and I am back with another video. So I know I look a little bit tough, but you guys, I just woke up like two hours ago and I have not moved a muscle because you guys are going to control my life today. Hmm. Before we get into this video, make sure you give it a thumbs up, hit that post notification bell, and hit the subscribe button because you already know this is about to be a banger. So you guys, about to start the day. It is 8.30 in the morning. I have an early start of the day. I have a lot to do today. Yeah, so we, we got an early start, but I'm about to go ahead with my first poll, and that is what should I have for breakfast, cereal, or a bagel? I would probably eat both, but we're gonna let you guys pick. I'm gonna give this a couple of minutes, and in the meantime, I'm going to shower and brush my teeth and wash my face, the normal stuff that I have to do every day. So I'm gonna go ahead and do that while you guys vote for what you want me to eat for breakfast. And when I come back, we'll decide how you guys want me to do my hair. All right, you guys, it is breakfast time. The people spoke, they voted on cereal. So I have some special K with some cut up bananas in there. And then I just have a avocado sandwich. Because this is not enough. That's breakfast for today. So I'm just going to chill in the office and probably get on the computer while I enjoy my breakfast. I'm really hungry, so I'm ready to eat. Just finished my breakfast. It was slap, okay? It was really good. I ate all of it kind of full. I could really like fall asleep right now. But we don't have time for that. It is time for poll number two. And that is how should I do my hair? So I just put posted this poll should i do it in a sleek high bun or a slick back pony right now the stats are 42 percent say slick high bun 58 percent say slick back pony so this is actually a slick back pony that my hair is in right now so that's kind of how i want to wear it because it's already like this so it's not going to be hard to do it over but i'm probably going to do that because the way it looks right now slick back pony is in the lead 927 people have voted for slick back pony 679 have voted for the high bun so slick back pony it is but before we do that, I need to ask you guys about my outfit. I have two outfit ideas in my head and it's like kind of like a bummy outfit and a cute outfit. So that's gonna be the two options, I guess. I'm gonna show you guys the outfits that I picked out for you guys to pick out. All right, guys, here is outfit number one. I have my Jordan 1s with black pants and a champion hoodie. I don't know if I'm gonna wear the champion one, but I know I'm going to wear a red one if they choose this outfit. The champion one is really warm and really comfortable, but it's a little big. I don't know if I wanna wear it big. I don't know, I have to see. That is outfit number one. And here is my bummy outfit, outfit number two. My Nike 270s polo jumpsuit, the matching polo, you know. So those are my two outfits. I have the bummy one and the kind of cute one. I'm gonna post these right now and ask you guys what you think about my outfits. All right, you guys, you asked for a slick back for my hairstyle. I also just posted another poll and asked you guys what makeup look you wanted. Did you want natural makeup or no makeup? For my poll about how I should do my hair, most of you guys chose the slick back. So we are going to redo this slick back right here. There's like a hundred hair dyes in here. Not even one. And like 3,000 bobby pins. I'm struggling. This hurts so bad. Oh my goodness. I have purple hair wax in my hair. Or I had it kind of went away. But there's still some there. So it's making my hands purple. But I was already prepared for that. Okay. We got the clip out. Mm. Now we have my spray bottle. I'm going to spray down my hair. Because this makes it. I can't comb it through dry. It has to be some kind of damp or wet or something. I'm going to try to do this as fast as I can because I don't like to take it forever. This part is kind of trash. Yes, got 
guys it was purple it got everywhere though i was kind of upset because it was cute and i liked it and it you can still see the purple in my hair but it got on my one of my pink sweatshirts and i know it can wash out it can wash out of my hair so i know it can wash out of that i was kind of upset because it got all over it This has become one of my favorite hairstyles to do. I used to like never ever do slip bags. And all of a sudden it became one of my favorites. It's really fun to do and I like how it looks. I forgot to put gel, but that's okay. So I'm gonna put some in there. So I don't know if you guys can see, but my ponytail is kind of purple. I kind of like it. It's kind of cute. I am really interested in seeing what the outfits are looking like. I'm hoping it's outfit number one. I have to do two scrunchies. It holds better for me if I do two. Okay, it's looking pretty good. Don't have any edges yet, but as far as the slick bag is concerned, looking pretty good. Most of this is coming off the brush because the brush was more purple than my hair. So now I'm gonna do my edges. So there's this look back. I don't know what to do with these pieces. This one's shorter than this one, but we're just gonna let them live. So here is the finished product of this look back. Now it's time to check the makeup pose, but first, before I touch my phone, I want to wash my hands. And we're back. Um, my hands are a lot less purple. Now it is just time to check the pose and see what you guys wanted as far as makeup, if you wanted none or just a natural look. Okay, so for makeup look, 68% of y'all said do a natural makeup look and 32% said no makeup. So it looks like we'll be doing natural makeup. 2,043 said makeup and 957 said none. Also for the outfit, 68% of you guys chose outfit number one. 32% chose outfit number two. I'm okay with that. I wanted outfit number one. So 2,152 of y'all said outfit number one and only 1,000 of you guys said outfit number two. And let's do this makeup. I'm the worst at makeup, the worst I know at least. There might be worser out there than me. All right, you guys, here is my natural makeup look. I was gonna add some highlights, but I'm just gonna do it right here. I'm trying to keep it natural, boy. I didn't do too much. I do have practice today, so um, this is gonna have to come off in like a couple hours. I did it for you guys. So now I'm going to put on outfit number one. That is the one that you guys chose. And then I'm gonna head out and we're gonna get something to eat. You guys are going to decide that as well. Let's go get into outfit number one. I am in my outfit. My mom picked me up. My next poll was where should I eat? Should I eat at a sit down restaurant or should I get fast food? And so far, sit down restaurant is winning. So we're gonna go with that. 53% said sit down restaurant and 47% said fast food. So we are at one of me and my mom's favorite places to eat, Phil Sandoval's. We love it. It's Mexican food and it's so good. But yeah, I'm really excited to eat because I'm hungry. I haven't eaten since breakfast. It's one o'clock. The only thing is you guys, I have basketball practice in literally less than an hour. So we're gonna have to make this lunch outing quick because at two o'clock I have to be at the gym and ready for practice. So we need to hurry, okay? Okay, mm, this smells good. What is that, Ted's barbecue? All right, you guys, this is what I got. I got a beef burrito with beans and rice. I'm hungry, I'm about to dig right in. It looks really good and I got a water. I'm in a rush guys, practice at two, it's like 1.15. We are back from Phil's, we're back in the car and we are on to practice. I like to get there early. I really wish you guys would have picked fast food for this one. On a normal day, I would have said, do not pick fast food, get a sit down restaurant. But because I am pressed for time, I wanted something fast, get it and go type stuff. I couldn't even eat all of my food on purpose. I wanted to, but I could not because I can't eat so close to practice. If I'm gonna eat really, really eat, it has to be like two and a half hours max before practice or else like 
it's not a great practice my stomach's turning and i have to throw up so i still think i ate a little more than i should have that's okay we are on our way to practice today you guys are still controlling my life after practice when i get back this slick bag is probably going to be no longer slicked back my makeup's probably going to be all up under my eyes if you guys would have picked no makeup or like a bun on top that would have been perfect for practice but it's okay i'm doing what you guys asked me to do today so i'm not tripping all right guys i'm at school on my practice I'm trying to go fast try to change real quick and get out there my teammates are out there getting shots up and i feel left out this is like that's everything i'm about to you okay we'll get back all right you guys i'm ready i put this headband on even though it's crazy back there i put the headband on to keep it as slick as possible so i'm about to go back out there and start shooting with my team um the boys team is out there right now but they're gonna be done in 10 minutes and then it's our turn so i just got out of practice it was tough i'm kind of tired okay so i'm about to do a poll and ask you guys if i should get the iphone 11 or the iphone 11 pro i have been wanting the iphone 11 pro for so long because the camera is really good my dad got it and i was able to test it out and i actually used it for one of my videos so ever since then i really wanted it so i'm gonna ask you guys which i should get all right you guys the poll is up there here it is i'm gonna pick this one so far i think i'm the only one who voted oh more people have voted oh my gosh people are saying the iphone 11. we are on our way to the apple store we are walking all the way from practice i'm just kidding but we are on the way to the apple store the lights behind me i apologize i wanted to go to the verizon store because that's not in bridge street which is this outdoor shopping mall so i would see have to run into less people because i literally look like trash but it's whatever gotta do what you gotta do hey guys update time it's like 6 30. we got there at 4 30. we are just now leaving the store and we are not even leaving with the phone we ran into like a mountain of problems we had to wait a really really long time but the man who works there we were talking about the osmo um osmo mobile and he he's he just gave it to us and i was like oh he gave it to us for our troubles So I was like excited. I didn't, I was not expecting that. Like we were just doing our own thing. And then he said, here you go, that's for you. That's on us. And I was like, what? And I, I was happy. I'm really hungry, my head hurts. But that's okay, we're gonna run to the car, put this stuff down, and then... We're gonna go eat. We're gonna go eat. Yeah, we have another hour and a half to wait for the phone. Cause like I said, we ran into a lot of problems. Man, guys, it is 7.30 been here since 4 30 when i tell you i just want to go home i mean it but we just got out of red robin apple called and they said your phone is ready to be picked up so we are on our way back down to apple we just have to walk down there we ate in the same plaza that we um that apple is in or the same outdoor mall so yeah it's kind of chilly but i'm glad i got my sweater and my outfit back on you guys I went to the car and threw the sweater on and I put the jeans over my Nike pros. So it's kind of uncomfortable, but it's whatever. Honestly, I'm excited just to get my phone, you guys. I just want it back. But we're going to get it, so it's okay. Hey guys, it's the next day. A lot happened last night. I didn't end up getting home until 8 something, 8.30 maybe. And remember, I got to the Apple Store at 4. We were there for a very long time. And a lot of that time, my phone was at the Apple Store. So I wasn't able to post any polls or continue the video. And plus, you guys were controlling my life for a day. And pretty much the day ended when I got home. And I got home very late. But I do have a lot to tell you guys about what happened like at the Apple Store why it took so long all that stuff so it did take a really long time for me to be able to get my new phone i did get the iphone 11 
Pro. The polls told me to get the iPhone 11 Pro, so I got it. I first was supposed to get it in space gray. This is not space gray. It looks very dark, but it's not space gray. But when they pulled it out, it was only a 64 gigabyte phone. That's what my mom ordered it to be. But I know that I cannot have 64 gigabytes. My last phone was a 256 and I was like at 100 and something. So I knew I couldn't get a 64 gigabyte phone. So they said they don't have any space grays in a 256. The closest thing they had was a midnight green. And at first I was like, okay, no, I don't want a green phone. But then they showed it to me and it's a really deep green. Like it looks, I really like it. I'm so glad I got this color. You can't even tell that it's green until I tell you that it's green. And then you're looking for the green and then you go, oh yeah, it is kind of like a deep green color. I really like it. After the three and a half, almost, four hours it took them for me to finally get the phone I needed a case so this is the one I chose it is an apple case it's that midnight green color I love it it matches the phone really well look at that you, you can tell that it's green when I put the green up to it but other than that it does not look green I'm very happy with it I also got the green band to match but here's the thing I'm not sure if he was the manager or I'm pretty sure he was I was picking out what I wanted and he was like it's okay I got you I got you it's on us it's on us and I was like you guys, they just gave me this case and they gave me this Apple Watch band. This is like a $50 band. Just a band for your Apple Watch is like $50. I was so shocked. And then on top of that, you guys, before I got my phone, before everything was settled, me and my dad and the people who were working on the phone for us, we were all talking about the Osmo Mobile 3, like I told you guys. They just gave it to us like... This thing is $139.95. When I tell you guys, I was like in so much shock. I was so happy. And on top of that, you guys know the regular accessories that comes with an iPhone. It's usually the block to charge the phone with, the charger, and some earbuds. They gave me all of that plus a double of it. Like, they really hooked me up. I was like so beside myself when he said, it's okay, we got it, it's on us. I was like... I don't know if he did that because it took four and a half hours, but I was not complaining at all. I would wait another, mm, that's fine. That might be pushing it. I don't know if I'd wait another four and a half hours. <laughs> but I was so happy. I was felt so grateful, so blessed. And like, that is awesome. He's a really nice man for that. But I love everything. I think it matches so well. Also, you guys, do not mind how I look. I just came for practice and I knew I had to end this video. It did not end as planned. I wanted to do more polls about dinner and like different stuff before I went to bed, but I honestly could not. Got home late. I was exhausted from just waiting for four and a half hours. I hope you guys understand. Thank you for participating if you voted on the polls. If you want to vote next time, make sure you follow my Instagram at LexiVO3. Give this video a big thumbs up, hit the post notification bell, and hit that subscribe button. I love you guys so much, and I will see you in the next one. Peace.